Vladimir, can you hear me? Go to room number two. Go to room number two. You're going to work with, uh, with Hector and with Karen, I think. Go to room number two. Okay, room, teacher. Room number two. Room number two. Go to room number two, Vladimir. Go to room number two. Okay. <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, very good, guys. Now, let me share with you. Okay, now, what is number two? Uh, Jacqueline, what is number two? Is she always is polite on the phone? Yeah, but remember, we said that when we have a verb, an auxiliary verb, the adverb frequency goes after the, auxil the auxiliary verb. So again? Uh, she always... No, she... She's uh -huh. always... Always... Polite on the phone. the phone. Okay, she's always polite on the phone. Okay, very good. Now, the next one. The next one will be. Uh, okay, Ricardo, number three. She uh, really She really. Really, very. Very was. Absolutely. Okay, she was very rarely, she was very rarely 
at work last year, okay? Now, forget about number three and number four because there are different tenses, okay? Now, number five, number five. Uh, number five, hold on, hold on, number five. Okay, uh, Francisca, number five, please. Okay. okay. Uh, number five. Obviously, if, you. Um, bueno, dije aquí en dos opciones. Yo la cuento de una forma y la compañera de otra, que es. It's always. No, number been... five. Number five. Number five. You, no, um, number four. Number three and number four, don't do it. Number five. Five. You never can win. No. Remember, when we have an auxiliary, such as can is an auxiliary, so the other frequency goes after the auxiliary. So you can never. Can never. Again, huh? You can never. Uh -huh. Never, never when no he... find him I'm sorry find him when you need him find you okay. find need you no it should be like this I'm sorry but okay it should be like this you 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 can, can never? never find him when you need him, okay? You can never find him when you need him. You can never find him when you find, need him. Fine, fine. You can never fine. find him when you need him. Fine. Usted nunca lo puede encontrar cuando lo necesita. Okay. okay. Now, the next one, let's see. Carlos Gonzalez. We have the, the the next one is is six. Yeah, number six. Uh, we have had problems. Never. We, no, we have never. Uh, we have never had problems. <laughs> had problems with him. With him. Okay. We have never had problems with him. Okay? Now, that is the correct answer, okay? Okay, the next one. Let me see. Uh, the next one. Carla. Number seven. We occasionally, occasionally uh -huh. travel to other countries. Very good. We occasionally travel to other countries. Number eight. Number eight. Catherine. How often do you? How often do you? Do you have? Renewed apart. Uh -huh. So that is correct. How often? How often do you do have you to have renew, been renewed uh -huh, apart. To renew your passport? Mm -hmm. Your passport. passport. Yes. So how often do you have to renew your passport? And that is a question. Okay. How often do you have to renew your passport? Okay, now we are going to do this together. Rewrite the complete sentence using the other frequency in brackets. Okay, so number one, uh, let's see. I'm going to start. Vladimir, number one, what is number one? They? They often, often go to the movies. They often go to the movies. Very good. Ricardo, number two. He writes 
listen to classic music. She rarely listens to classical music. Very good. Vicente, number four. Ah, number three. He sometimes reads the local newspaper. Okay, very good. Marlon, number four. Sara never smiles. Sara never smiles. Very good. Melissa, number five. Um. She always complains about her husband. Very good. Catherine, number six. Yeah. I sometimes drink coffee. Very good. Carla, number seven. Frank often. Remember. Frank is, Frank no. is often. Uh -huh. Ill. Frank is often ill. Ill means sick, enfermo. So Frank is often ill. Remember, after auxiliary verb, the adverb of frequency. Okay, very good. Let's see. Okay, Hector, number eight, please. He usually feels terrible. Very good. Cindy, number nine. I always go jogging in the morning. Okay, go jogging is trotar. I always go jogging, go jogging in the morning. Very good. Brenda, number 10. She never helps her daughter with her homework. She never helped her, her daughter with her homework. Very good. Paulo, number 11. We... Always watch television in the evening. Very good, very good. Next, uh, Eunice. I, I never smoke. Very good, Carlos. Uh, I seldom eat meat. Okay, very good, Francisca. I always it's vegetable vegetables vegetable and fruit and fruit okay repeat after me everybody okay i of, they often go to the movies she rarely listens to classical music she rarely, she rarely listens to classical music. music he sometimes reads the local newspaper he sometimes reads the local newspaper. Sarah never smiles. Sarah never smiles. She always complains about her husband. She always complains about her husband. I sometimes drink coffee. I sometimes drink coffee. Frank is often ill. Frank is often ill. He usually feels terrible. He usually, he usually feels, feels terrible. terrible. I always go jogging in the morning. I, I always, always go jogging, jogging in the morning. In the morning. In the morning. In the morning. She never helps her daughter with her homework. She, she never We always watch television in the evening. We always watch television in the evening. I never smoke. I never smoke. I seldom eat meat. I seldom eat meat. I seldom eat meat. I always eat vegetables and fruits. I Okay, question about pronunciation or vocabulary. Vegetable. Repeat after me. Vegetable. 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 I always go jogging in the morning. Jogging. Always. Uh -huh. Repeat after me. I always go jogging in the morning. I always go jogging in the morning. Jogging. 
Jogging. Jogging. Jogging. Yo siempre voy a trotar en la mañana. Jogging. Sí, trotar. Sí. Jog. Ok. More questions? No. No more questions. Ok. Do you remember imperatives? Complete the given imperative sentences by filling in with the appropriate word from the choices provided. For example, what is correct? Remember imperatives. Remember a uh, listen, uh, stop, don't uh, walk to the end of the classroom. You remember imperatives and negative imperatives. Don't eat in class. So what is number one? Ronnie, please let the, let kid play. the kids play. Yeah, it could be the right one. Ronnie, please let the kids play or let the kids play. So both are possible, okay? Very good. Now, number two. What is number two? Let's see, Melissa. Do your work. Do your work, very good. Do your work, okay, very good. Now, Vicente, what is the next one? Switch off the light. Switch off the light, very good. And in this one, it could be both, okay? Now, eh, Eunice, what is number three? Number four. Here are the options, A, B, and C. Study well for the exam. Uh -huh. Study well for the exam, that is correct, very good. Carlos Gonzalez, what is the next one? Eh... Uh... Fill the jar full. Fill the jar full. That is correct. Now, fill, llenar. And the jar, el jarrón, lleno. Lléneme el jarrón, lleno. Okay? Okay. Very good. Next, Francisca, what is number six? Mm. Mm. Preet, preheat. Preheat, repeat Pre after me, preheat. 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 Uh -huh. preheat. Preheat the oven, the oven before you bake. Bake, bake. Bake, bake. Uh -huh. That is correct, preheat. Preheat. Preheat the oven the oven before, before you bake. You bake. Where, where bake. is preheat? Preheat. Heat, Bring calentar. Heat. And preheat, precalentar. Mm -hmm. Your mm -hmm. oven es su horno antes de hornear. Mm -hmm. Entonces, precaliente el horno antes de hornear. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Jacqueline, number seven. Uh, add more sugar to the coffee. Add more sugar to the coffee. What is the meaning of add? Agregar. Agregar, uh -huh. agregue más azúcar al café. Very good. Angela, no. Cristina, number eight. Um, throw, throw. Uh -huh. Throw? In the ball. Throw him the ball. What is the meaning of throw? Lanzar. Lanzar o tirar. Tírele la pelota o láncele la pelota. Very good. Number nine, Carlos González. Okay, is uh, uh, pass the salt, please. Pass the salt, please. Okay, very good. Okay, the next one, Marlon. Pick up the phone. Pick up the phone. What is the meaning of pick up? <laughs> Levante el teléfono. Pick up the phone. Okay, very good. Okay, the next one will be for Cindy. What is the next one, Cindy? Respect. Respect. Okay. No, 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 number 11, number 11. I... Clean, clean your room. Clean your room. That is correct. Very easy. 
Okay, Brenda, number 12. Respect. Respect. Always. Uh -huh. Your elders always. Very good. Now, the next one. Hector, number 13. Please leave to the room. Please, okay, leave the room untidy. No, let me see. No. So that would be no. negative. Don't leave to run untidy. Uh -huh. Don't leave the room untidy, right? That means dirty and disorganized. Paulo, number 14. Listen. Attentively. Attentively. In class. In, in class. Okay. Catherine. Mm. Uh -huh. Please. These are the options. Uh -huh. Please. Taylor, call him after office no, hours. No. No. Vladimir. Please. Please don't call him after office exactly. hours. Exactly. Please don't call him after office hours. Very good. Number 16. Hey, let me see. Carla? Um, go get... Go. Get the children from school. Go get the children from school. Very good. The next one. Let me see. Let me go back. Okay. Angela. Angela. Number 17. Follow the rules. Follow the rules. Very good. Follow the rules. Cristina. Remove the shoes outside. Remove the shoes outside. Very good. Francisca, number 19. 19. Um, Mountain. 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 A strict discipline in a studying in a student's life. A student's life. Okay, very good. Ca Mating. Carlos. ¿Qué significa esta palabra? Ajá, uh -huh. mantenga estricta disciplina en la vida del estudiante. Okay, maintain, maintain a strict discipline in a student's life. Very good. Carlos. Okay, is Please hold the back for me. Please hold the back for me. Okay, questions about pronunciation. Questions about vocabulary. Okay. My pronunciation, pronunciation my maintain, 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 maintain. Everybody repeat after me. Maintain. 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 Maintain a strict discipline in a student's Maintain. life. Maintain a strict discipline in the student's student life. life. Okay, very good. More questions. Check it out, please. Check it out. What is the meaning elders? Elders means all people. All people. Elder, anciano, old people. Elders, old people. Old people. More questions? More questions? No teacher. No questions? No. Elders, old people, elders, ancianos. Gente vieja, elders. Please. Which one? 
Brigitte. What number? What number? Um, six. Ah, number six. Uh, number six. Preheat. Precalentar. Precalentar, es así, precalentar. Uh -huh. En the oven, el horno. En bake, antes de hornear, before you bake. Preheat the oven before you bake. More questions? No more. No more, teacher. Okay, repeat after me. Let the kids play. Let, let the kids, the kids, kids play. 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 Ronnie, yeah. please let the kids play. Ronnie, Ronnie please, please let, let, let the kids, the kids play. play. Do you work? Do you, Do you work? work? Do you work? Do you work? Do you work? the lights. Switch up the lights. Light. 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 Study well for the exams. Fill the jar full. Fill the jar full. full. Preheat the oven before you bake. Preheat the oven before you bake. Add more sugar to the coffee. Add sugar more sugar, 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 sugar to the coffee. The coffee. Throw him the ball. Throw him the ball. The ball. The ball. The ball. The ball. Pass the salt, please. Pass, Pass the, the salt, salt please. please. Pick up the phone. Pick, Pick up, up the phone. phone. Clean your room. Clean your room. Clean your room. Respect your elders always. always. Respect your elders always. always. Don't leave the room untidy. Don't leave the room untidy. Don't. Lee, uh, pardon, I'm sorry. Listen attentively in class. Listen attentively in class. Repeat after me. Attentively. Attentively. Uh -huh. Listen attentively in class. Attentively in class. Listen attentively in class. Listen attentively in class. Uh -huh. The meaning is, escuche atentamente in class. Right? Okay, don't, please don't call him after office hours. Please don't call him after office hours. Office hours. Office hours. 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 Follow the rules. Follow the rules. Follow the rules. Remove the shoes outside. Remove the shoes outside. Maintain a strict discipline in a student's life. Maintain a strict discipline in a student's life. Please hold the bag for me. Please hold the bag, hold the bag for me. What is the meaning of this one? Por favor. Tenga la bolsa for me. Okay, so please hold the bag for me. Okay, so those were imperatives. Remember? Imperatives. Now, we're going to practice with put have to or has to into the gaps. So what is number one? They have to write. Okay, very good. They have to write a test. Okay, now you are going to do this in pairs, please. Okay, so I'm going to break you into groups. Okay, so you can do this in pairs. So recreate the same groups. Okay, now go. Uh, Francisca. Uh, go, uh, okay, never mind. Group number one is Francisca, Hector, and Jacqueline. Group number two, Liliana and Paulo, Melissa and Paulo. Group number three, Carlos and Ricardo. Group number four, Eunice and Brenda. Group number five, Cindy and Marlon. Group number six, Angela and Christina go to group Number six, and work with Karen, please. Group number six, Angela. Uh, group number seven, Carla and Vladimir. Group number eight, Catherine and Vicente. Okay, very good. Cindy, go to group number five, Cindy. 
Group number five, Cindy. You don't have a partner, uh, Eunice? No, no se ha conectado. Vaya, ok, ahorita le voy a conseguir uno, ok. Gracias. Uh, ¿En cuál está? Grupo número. En el cuatro, me haya dicho. En el cuatro, va, ok, very good. Ok, group number four. There you go. Héctor. Go to group number four, Hector. Go okay. To, and here you go. Okay, practice with Unice, please. Okay. That's good. Okay, very good. And... Here's... Okay, very good, you finish. Okay, so I'm going to stop the groups because I see that you already Your microphone is off, teacher. Okay. I can't Thank hear you. you. Thanks for reminding me. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so let me let me get to here. Okay. Number one. What is number one, uh, Marlon? And number one is have two. They no, no, have but the complete items. sentence. The complete yeah, sentence. But sorry, 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 teacher. <laughs> They have to write a test. Very good. Carlos Gonzalez, number two. Uh, the number two is she has to clean her desk. Very good. Paulo, number three. Ken and Liz has to learn English words. Is that correct? Ken and Liz has? Have. 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 Remember, have. Ken and Liz is they. So here has to be have to. Oh, yeah, 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 sorry. Okay, no problem, no problem. Okay, very good. 
Uh, Hector, what is number four? Andy has to help his brother. Andy has to help his brother. Very good. Vladimir, number, number five. We have to do our homework. We have to do our homework. Francisca, number six. Turn on your microphone, Francisca. Excuse me. It's okay. He has great uh, with a pencil. He has to write. He has, to write. He has to write. To write with, with a, pencil. a pencil. Very good. Eunice, number seven. He has? No, number seven. Number seven. Ah. I have feed the hamster. No, no, I have to feed the hamster. Very good. Number eight. Uh, Jacqueline. You you have take a take photos. Remember, you have to have to. Again, again, again. You have to take photos. Very good. Cristina, number nine. Victoria has to read the newspaper. Very good. And number 10, Angela? The teacher has to send a message. A text message. Okay, very good. Everybody repeat after me. They have to write a test. <laughs> they, they have, have to write a, write a test. test. She has to clean her desk. She, she has, has to clean her, her desk. desk. Ken and Liz have to learn English words. Andy has to help his brother. Andy, Andy, has, Andy has, has to help his brother. We have to do our homework. We have to do our homework. He has to write with a pencil. He has, he has to write, to write with a pencil. pencil. I have to feed the hamster. I have to, I have to feed the, the, the hamster. You have to take photos. You have, you you have, to, have take photos. to take photos. Have photos. Victoria has to read the newspaper. Victoria, Victoria has, has to read the newspaper. Read the, newspaper. the teacher has to send a text message. The teacher, the teacher has, has to send a text message. Okay, now all of these are you are going to express necessity. So it's getting late. I need to go now. Is that clear? So you are going to use need or needs to. Need to or needs to. Example number one is getting late. I need to go now. Is that clear? Okay, so now we are going to break the rule, the, the groups again, okay? Ten groups, create again, and now go to the group. You have three minutes. You have to hurry up. Three minutes. Uh, Marlon and Vladimir go to room one. Francisca and Vicente, room two. Karen and Carla, room three. Eunice, Angela, and Cristina go to room four. Hector and Liliana are there. Jacqueline, go to room number six, please. Cindy to room number seven. Catherine, room number eight, please. Okay, Catherine, group number eight, please. Cindy, room number seven, Cindy. Catherine, room number eight, please. Cindy, okay, very good. Catherine, room number eight. Catherine, Catherine, room number eight. Uh -huh. Go ahead, go ahead. Do the exercises, please. <laughs> okay, go, go. El material ahí lo tiene usted. 
Catherine. Catherine. There, here we go. Okay. So number two, what is number two, Ricardo? Uh, he likes to discuss uh, prices. In so he? He likes. Needs, he needs to. He needs to. Use. Use crutches. Crutches for a month. Okay, Catherine, number two. Catherine. Catherine. Okay, Ricardo, number two. Um, wait, wait, Catherine. Okay, Catherine, number three. I necessize. No, I need. Remember, remember, you are going to use need to or needs to. Okay, that's what you're going to use. So, number three. Mm -hmm. I need to. Uh -huh, I need to talk. Okay, Ricardo, number three. I need to, to call talk to. No, to talk to talk. Talk to and about it. Okay, Kate, Catherine, number number four. She. Catherine, she? She needs to the bank. She needs to go. Here is supposed to be, she needs to go to the bank. Okay, number five, Ricardo. Uh, we, need, we need to help him. We need to help him. Number six, Kate. Catherine? You, you, need, you need to in your homework by Thursday. Okay, very good. Ricardo. I need to go with you tomorrow. Very good. Number eight, Catherine. No. Uh-huh, Catherine. You Uh -huh, Catherine, number eight, number eight. To read it after. Uh -huh, you need to read it after all. And number nine, Ricardo. Uh, Maria needs to take the box in the morning. In the morning, very good. Let's come back, okay? Yeah. Let's come back. Hola. Hello, guys. Do you finish practicing? Very simple, right? Okay. Okay, let's see. Uh, Hector, number number two. Number two. Wait, wait, wait. Let me let me let me turn. Let me turn down the music. Okay, this is my, my ah. sister. My sister don't have me. He left is in the cast and he needs to use brushes, brushes for a month. For a month. Okay, very good. Now the next one, uh, Carla. Number three. I need to tell. To Anne about it. I need to talk to Anne about it. Ricardo, number four. And she needs to go to the bank. To the bank. She needs to go to the bank. Number five, Karen. Ahorita. We need to help him. We need to help him. Very good. Catherine, number six. 
you need? Ah, uh -huh, complete, complete. To, to turn? Homework by Thursday. Ah, uh -huh, you need to turn in your homework by Thursday. Melissa, number seven. I need to go with you tomorrow. Very good. Number eight, Jacqueline. You, you need read it after all. You need to read it. You need to read, read it. it after all. Okay. You need to read it after all. Okay, very good. Marlon, number nine. Mary needs to take the bus in the morning. Okay, everybody, questions about pronunciation or vocabulary? Crochet, no. crochets. Crutches, muletas. Okay. And his leg is in a cast. Su pierna está en un yeso. And he needs to use crutches for a month. Okay? More questions. Okay. More questions? Turn in. Turn in quiere decir entregar. So you need to turn in your homework by Thursday. Usted tiene, necesita entregar su tarea para el jueves. You need to read it after all. Usted necesita leerlo después de todo. Okay? No questions? No questions. No questions. Okay, repeat after me. It's getting late. I need to go now. It's getting to go now. To go I now. Need to go now. now. What happened, Francisca? <laughs> okay, no. again. It's getting late. I need to go now. It's getting, it's getting late. late. I, I need, need to go, go now. 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 His now. leg is in a cast and he needs to use crutches for a month. His leg is in a cast. He needs his crutches for a month. I need to talk to Anne about it. I need to, I need to, to talk to Anne about, about, about it. About. She needs to go to the bank. She needs to go to the bank. We need to help him. We need, need to, help to help him. Help him. Help him. Help him. You need to turn in your homework by Thursday. You need to turn in your homework by Thursday. 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 Okay, very good. I and to... I need to go with you tomorrow. I need, I need to go with you tomorrow. With you, tomorrow. tomorrow. you need to read it after all. You need to read it after all. You need to read it after all. Mary needs to take the bus in the morning. Mary needs to take the bus in the morning. 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 Okay, now listen to this. Okay, let me share this with you. Okay, uh, first of all, let me call it. Okay. Okay, can you see what I have in, in here? Yes. Okay, now when we. Vaya, fíjese bien, cuando nosotros hablamos de años, para decir 1629, nosotros en inglés separamos y rompemos de dos cifras en dos cifras. Por ejemplo, 1629. 1629. So you separate two, uh -huh, by two, okay? 1629, 1632, 1639, repeat after me, 1629, 1632, 1649 1649 1650 1650 1710 1710 
18 cienes. ¿Qué quiere decir? 1800. Es más práctico. Entonces, dice 1800. 1800. 1800. 1800. 1800. Eso solo sucede con los cienes exactos. 700, 800, except 1000. ¿Ok? So, 1904. Vaya, y cuando comience de 01 a 09, usted va a decir 1904. Oh. 1904. 1906. 1906. Ajá. Y con 2000, 2000, hasta llega hasta el 9, 2001, 2002, 2003, hasta que llega a 2009. De allí ya oh, puede decirlo de las dos maneras. 2011 o 2011. 2017 o 2017. Okay. Solo con los 2000. Del 10 en adelante se puede decir de las dos maneras. Ok. Por ejemplo, aquí. 2020 o 2020. 2028 o 2028. Ok. Vaya. Repeat after me. 1800. 1800. 1805 del 2000 al 2009 tengo que decir 2001 2002 2003 2001, 2002, 2009. Del 2010 en adelante, lo puedo decir de dos 2011 o 2011. 2017 o 2017. 2020 o 2020. 2028 o 2028. ¿Ok? Bien. Vamos a comenzar. Voy a comenzar desde el último. Catherine, number one. Catherine. Vaya, ayudémosle todos como es la primera. Sixteen Paulo, number two. 1632 1632 Carlos the next one 1649 very good Eunice the next one 60 50 uh -huh. 60 50 very good next uh, Vicente 1664. Very good. Cindy. 1673. 73. Very good. Eh, Vladimir. 1688. <laughs> 86. 86. Jacqueline. Uh, 1698. Melissa. 17. Very good. Karen. 1721. Hector. 1733. Okay, very good. Cristina. 1746. 
No, this one. No, okay, 1746, Angela. 1759. Okay, very good. Cindy. <laughs> Seventy seven six seventy six okay seventy sixty sixty two sixty two okay very good uh, let me see let me go by this one it's better okay so Hector the next one seventeen seventy seventy six Okay, Eunice. 1788. Uh, 89, 89. Okay, Melissa. Eight, eight, no, 1800. 1800. Okay, very good. Marlon. 1812. 1812, very good. Carlos. Uh, eight, 18, 20, 27. 1827. Very good. Francisca. 1834. Very good. Uh, Angela. 18, Okay, Cristina. 1853. Okay, very good. Let me see. Jacqueline. And qual, qual teacher? Right here. Uh, 1868. Okay, very good. Ricardo. 1899. 1899, Vicente. 2004. No, 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 no. Remember? 1904. 1904. 1904. 1904. Cindy. 196. No. 1906. Remember? 1906. 1906. Okay, Ricardo. Uh, 1915. Okay, Marlon. 19. No, sorry. Uh, just 1918. Okay, Carla. 1920. Okay, Karen. Oh, uh, 19. Gathering. 1930, 50. No, 35, 1935. Okay. Okay, let me see, Hector. 1937. Okay, Jacqueline. Uh, 1942. Okay, very good, Eunice. 1945. Okay, Carlos. 1953. No, 53. 53. 53. Again? 53. 19. Uh, 53. 53. Okay, Francisca. 1958. Okay, very good. Cristina. 1961. Yeah, Angela. 1969. Okay. Uh, Melissa. 1970. Okay, very good. Let me see. 1973. Okay. 1973. Okay, very good. Ricardo. Uh, 1982. 1982. Karen. 
1988. Carla. 1991. Eh, Cindy. 1996. Catherine. 200. 200. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000. Eleven. Two thousand eleven. Two thousand eleven or twenty eleven. Uh, Christina. And twenty seventeen. Twenty seventeen. Okay, very good. Eunice. Twenty twenty. Twenty twenty. Carlos. Twenty twenty-eight. Okay, very good. Karen. 2034. 20, okay, very good. Uh, Vicente. 2048. Excellent. Ricardo. 2055. 2055. Very good. Next, uh, Catherine. 20. 64. 2064. Carla. 2078. Brenda. Brenda, Brenda. Brenda is not here. Okay, volunteer, the last one. 2083. Very good. Now, okay, now we're going to go. Okay. Now, save the dates. You remember this? Save the date. Save the date. Remember, August 25th. August 25th. Uh, Melita, number two. May 11th. May 11th. Okay, Jacqueline. March 8th. March 8th. Remember, 8th. 8th. Okay, very good. Francisca. October 23. No, no 23. 20? 23rd. 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 Okay, very good. Next, let me see. Angela. June. No, 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 no. Uh -huh, yeah, June. 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 14th. 14th. 14. June 14. Aha, uh -huh, okay. June 14. June 14. <laughs> Cristina. December 31st. 31st. Uh -huh, December 31st. Carla. February 2. No, second. no, two. Ordinal number. February 2nd. February 2nd, Ricardo. July 15th. July 30th, 30th. Hector. September 6th. September 6th. Let me see who is next. Vladimir. January uh, 13th. January 13th, okay, now. I'm gonna give you a couple of a couple of minutes. Repeat after me. When is New Year's Day? When is New Year's Day? Day? When is Valentine's Day? Day? When is Valentine's Day? Day? When, is Day? Day? when is Easter holiday? When is Easter holiday? When is Labor's Day? When is Labor's Day? When is Mother's Day? When, when is Mother's, Mother's Day? Day? When is Father's Day? When is, when is Mother's Day? Day? When is Teacher's Day? When is Teacher's Day? Day? When is the USA Independence Day? When is the USA Independence Day? When is, when is, Day? Day? When is Central America? Oh no, when is August holiday? 
When is When is Central America Independence Day? When is, when is a Central American, American Independence, Independence, Day? Independence Day? When is Children's Day? When is, when is Children's, Children's Day? Day? When is Memorial's Day? When is, when is Memorial's Day? Day? When is Guadalupe's Day? When is Guadalupe's Day? Guadalupe Day? Day? When is Christmas Eve? When is Christmas Day? When is Christmas Day? Okay, questions. What is difference? Christmas, uh, Christmas, Air. Air, uh, Air. Air. Christmas Day. Okay, Air. Christmas Eve is La Noche Buena, es Diciembre 24. Y el día de Navidad es diciembre 25. Christmas. Thank you, teacher. Christmas Day, December 25th. Christmas Eve, December 24th. The same happens with New Year's Day. New Year's Day is January 1st. New Year's Eve is December 31st. Okay. Questions about this? Questions, questions. No question. Are you sure? Labor's Day? Mr. Holiday. Huh? Mr. Holiday. Mr. Holiday is Semana Santa. Semana Santa. Vacaciones de Semana Santa. Labor's Day, Día del Trabajador. Uh -huh. Día de Independencia de Estados Unidos. Eh, Children's Day, Día del Niño. July 4th. Halloween, Memorial Day, El Día de los Muertos, Memorial Day, Guadalupe Day, December 12th, remember December 12th, and Christmas Eve, okay, now I will give you, I will give you five minutes, no, ten minutes, so you can ask and answer the question, ahora, fíjese bien, el propósito es que practiquemos los meses y los números ordinales. Así que pregúnteme, what is New Year's Day? It's January 1st. It's January 1st. It's January 1st. It's January 1st. January 1st, right? It's January 1st. Ok, vaya. Como esto no se los mandé yo a usted, tómele una foto. Tómele una foto porque lo voy a mandar en grupos. Para que, para, para que se hagan las preguntas. So take Hello. a picture, please. Gracias. Take a picture. Take a picture. Okay, Cindy. teacher. Ya, teacher. Ya. Eh, Unice, ya, ya le tomó no foto. Ahorita, teacher. Ahorita. Cindy. Francisca. Yes. Melissa. Yes. Yes. Is when is this. Vicente, Vladimir, Carla, you took a picture. Okay, so let me break you into groups. Ya lo puedo me pone, mandar en grupos. Yes. Okay, here we go. Gracias, Carlos, por mandarla al grupo. Okay, here we go. You're welcome. Francisca and Ricardo, room number one. Vladimir, room number two. Jacqueline, room number three. Karen and Catherine, room number four. Angela, room number six. Angela and Cristina, room okay. number six. Cindy, room number seven. Eunice, room number eight, please. Cindy, room number... Room number seven, Cindy. Me escucha. No me aparece la opción. No le aparece. No. Vaya, momentito, Quizás. momentito. La voy a mandar a la sala número. Ay, no. Pues. ¿Segura no le aparece? Vaya, la voy a mandar con. Carlos y Marlon, ok, a la sala número 4. Ok, vaya a la sala número 4. Y Paulo lo voy a mover a la sala número 8.
Ice Time ya. Y ahora sala número 4, Cindy. ¿Qué pasó? ¿No le parece la opción otra vez? Cindy. Ah, va, ok. When is okay. the USA? Ah, no, es, es tu turno. Mira, when is the USA Independence Day? It's uh, July 4th. When is August holiday? It's the first week of uh, August. Okay. Of August. It's the first week of August. Is the, is, is the first week of August. No, it's not August. It's oh, oh, oh. Oh, August. Oh, August. <laughs> August. August. <laughs> August. Um, hi. When is Central America America Independence Day? It's September 15th. When is Children's Day? Oh my gosh. Hi, Tari. Finish. Sisca. No listening. No uh, listening. For tomorrow, for tomorrow, no, I need you that you go and uh, let me see only Eunice and Karen. No, Karen, ya. Yeah. Solo de Unice en, en Catherine. Los que no hayan terminado la plataforma hasta, el, hasta la tarea 10. Tienen que terminar la tarea 10. Y para mañana necesito que hagan el examen, el midterm. ¿Ok? 
Midterm hasta mañana. A medio término, como ya terminamos la unidad 2 y, y este curso es de cuatro unidades, ahorita vamos al examen de medio término. Ok. El examen es, es la misma pregunta que hicieron en las tareas. ¿Estamos de acuerdo? O sea, que si usted se sacó 10 en la tarea, se va a sacar 10 en el examen. Ok. Lo único que el examen viene de 20 preguntas. Son las mismas preguntas que usted hizo en las tareas. ¿Estamos de acuerdo? Vaya, aquí tiene el mismo. Para mañana, por favor, hagan el examen. Así ya puedo subir las notas. Ok. Ok. ¿De acuerdo? Ok. Ok. Sí, sí, sí. Hola. Vaya, también le mandé el material de la unidad 3. Ok. Va, eso lo vamos a comenzar a utilizar mañana. Así que téngalo listo, por favor. Ok. okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you very Feliz much. día del docente, Feliz teacher. Ok. And have a good night. Ok. Go rest. And prepare for the teacher tomorrow. Have a good night. Okay, bye bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Adiós, Cindy. Ah. Adiós, Jacqueline. Adiós. Have a good, good night. night. Good night. Bye. 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 B